Cochin University of Science and Technology CUSAT, is a government-owned autonomous science and technology university in Kochi, Kerala, India. Founded in 1971, it has three campuses, two in Kochi and one in Kutanad, Alapuja, 66 km inland. The university awards degrees in engineering and science subjects at the undergraduate, postgraduate and doctoral levels. Topic overview Originally known as the University of Cochin, the university came into being in 1971 through an act of the Kerala legislature that was the result of a campaign for postgraduate education in the state. It was reorganized into Cochin University of Science and Technology CUSAT, in February 1986. The objectives were the promotion of undergraduate and postgraduate studies and advanced research in applied science, technology, industry, commerce, management and social sciences. Admissions are based on an all India entrance examination known as the Common Admission Test, CAT, conducted by the university which includes papers for admission to undergraduate and postgraduate courses. Departmental admission tests, DAT, are conducted for some postgraduate courses. CUSAT has at present 29 departments of study and research offering graduate and postgraduate programs across a wide spectrum of disciplines in frontier areas of engineering, science, technology, humanities, law and management. The university has academic links and exchange programs with several institutions across the globe. A new species of amphipod collected from the Cochin backwater has been named Victoriapisa casatensis after university in 2018. Topic Motto The motto of the university is T has been a vad the mass too, which conveys May the wisdom accrue deify us both the teacher and the taught, and percolate to the universe in its totality, which is taken from the Vedas. Topic Rankings CUSAT was ranked 801 1000 in the world by the Times Higher Education World University Rankings of 2018 and 251 to 300 in Asia. While considering an endowment of under $0.5 million CUSAT shows way beyond excellence while comparison with other world universities. <laughs> Campuses The university has three campuses two in Kochi, one at Palinkanu, Kutanad, Alapuja about 65 km south of Kochi in the state of Kerala. <laughs> Main Thrikakara campus The main campus is 1.5 km off the National Highway 47 in South Kalamassery. The 180-acre campus consists of the administrative office, the central library, 
computer center, departments, labs, workshops, School of Engineering SOE campus, Kunjali Marikar School of Marine Engineering, School of Management Studies, School of Legal Studies, canteens, guest house, hostels and playgrounds. The computerized central library is a source of information for CUSAT students and academics. The computer center provides free Internet access to the students. The campus hosts the buildings of the departments. The SOE campus has divisions of engineering and corresponding labs and workshops. The SOE campus block consists of classrooms for engineering courses and a new lab building which houses department centers and labs. Men's hostels are Sanathana Siberia Sarovar Swaraj Sahara Sagar, women's hostels are Ashwarya, Anashwara, Athulia, Anaga, Ananya, Alakananda. The campus hosts the accommodation of its employees. Topic: <laughs> Lakeside Campus. The lakeside campus, around 12 km from the main campus, is set in Fine Arts Avenue Road, Cochin City on the Estuarine waterfront. It consists of the School of Marine Sciences, School of Industrial Fisheries, Department of Physical Oceanography, Department of Atmospheric Sciences, Department of Chemical Oceanography, Department of Marine Biology, Microbiology and Biochemistry, Department of Marine Geology and Geophysics and the School of Marine Sciences has a library that is regarded as one of the largest marine science libraries in Asia and a research vessel for coastal water studies. The school has academic interactions with other universities and research institutes in India and outside. Topic: <laughs> Palinkanu Campus. The Palinkanu campus in Kutanad, Alappuzha district is 65 kilometers from the main campus. It is home to the Cochin University College of Engineering Kutanad, C -U -C -E -K, and the Cochin University College of Computer Applications C -U -C -C -A. The campus is surrounded by water scenery, temples and churches. <laughs> Faculties. CUSAT is structured into nine faculties Science Technology Engineering Environmental Studies Humanities Law Marine Sciences Medical Sciences and Technology Social Sciences Topic. Faculty of Science Topic. Department of Physics The present-day Department of Physics of the Cochin University of Science and Technology first came into existence as the Department of Physics of the Ernakulam Center of the University of Kerala in the year 1963. 
the Department of Physics was founded by Professor K. Venkateswarlu with a moderate beginning and it gradually grew to a center of excellence with emphasis on teaching and research. Today the Department of Physics is well known within India and abroad for its contribution in teaching and research. During its existence for the last 50 years, it has made rapid strides in the realm of research, both in experimental and theoretical physics. The major thrust areas of the department are theoretical physics and material science. Research in the frontier areas of nanoscience and technology, optoelectric devices, quantum computing, semiconductor devices, solar cells, holographic materials, high-density storage batteries, astrobiology and quantum optics are also underway in the department. The department offers postgraduate programs namely MSc physics, MPhil physics and PhD. The Department of Physics is also a recipient of generous financial assistance in the form of sponsored projects from various agencies viz. UGC, AICTE, IUCAA, DST, DRDO, CSIR, IUAC, DAY, KSCSTE and others. The faculty members of the department are engaged in active collaborative research with their counterparts at the national and international level. Some of the leading institutions with which they interact are NCL, Pune, NIIST, Trivandrum, Inter University Accelerator Centre, New Delhi, IGCAR, Kalpakam, VSSC, Trivandrum, IUCAA, Pune, and others. They also have ongoing collaborative programs with faculty members from NTU, Singapore, NUS, Singapore, Rice University, USA, Toyo University, Japan, Tokyo Institute of Technology, Japan and Iwate University, Japan. The department possesses the following instruments for research, thickness profilometer, spectrophotometer, fluorimeter, liquid nitrogen plant, high temperature furnace, X-ray diffractometer, ND, YAG laser, vacuum unit for laser plasma studies, HP 4192 LCR meter, IV characterization unit for PN junction, Hall measurement system, optical microscope, differential scanning calorimeter, HRXRD, XPS, FTIR, FESEM. These facilities are thrown open for users within and outside the state on nominal charges depending on the availability of the instrument time. The Department of Physics conducts a science awareness program in physics and space quiz called National Space Olympiad in association with IUCAA Resource Center, CUSAT and Ejimithra Intellectual Services. Topic: <laughs> Department of Applied Chemistry. The Department of Applied Chemistry was established in 1976 with the support of University Grants Commission to aid in the development of the industrial belt in the Greater Cochin area by providing scientific support and trained personnel to industry. The department started an MSc program in Applied Chemistry in 1971. An M.Phil program in chemistry was started in 1986. 
the department has served as a nucleus for starting the Department of Polymer Science and Rubber Technology and the Department of Biotechnology, by initiating B.Tech and MSc courses. The department has international collaborations with National Technical University Singapore, Card Scientific USA, Limerick University, Ireland, Polish Academy of Sciences Poland, Sultan Qaboos University Muscat, Bois State University USA and University of Science Malaysia. The department also organizes outreach programs for school children to inculcate an aptitude for science and conduct such programs in collaboration with KSCSTE, Kerala State Science and Technology Museum etc. Topic: <laughs> Department of Mathematics. The Department of Mathematics conducts a master's degree program in mathematics and operations research and computer applications along with MPhil and PhD programs. The research scholars in the department are in receipt of fellowship from Government of India funding agencies such as University Grants Commission. Council of Scientific and Industrial Research, and the National Board for Higher Mathematics NBHM. Research activities are in analysis, algebra, operator theory, functional analysis, general topology, fuzzy mathematics, graph theory, combinations, convexity theory, fluid dynamics, nonlinear waves, stability, stochastic processes in general and random graphs, operations research and the history of mathematics. Topic Department of Statistics The Department of Statistics was established in 1996 by bifurcating the erstwhile School of Mathematical Sciences. The department offers M Science degree program in statistics, M Tech in engineering statistics and research leading to PhD degree. In addition to traditional teaching in statistics, the department is actively engaged in research in several areas of statistics The Statistical Computing Laboratory of the department has several licensed software which include SAS, SPSS and MATLAB. The department has a metrology laboratory with sophisticated instruments such as CNC trainer, CMM machine and other metrological instruments. There is a center of population studies established in the department aimed at conducting research in demography and several other fields of social interest. The department has close academic interaction with University of Waterloo, Dalhousie University, Canada, Indian Statistical Institute, Calcutta, University of Dresden, Germany and University of Warwick, United Kingdom. Consultancy services are being offered to some industrial establishments and R&D institutions in the state in the field of data analysis, planning of surveys and quality improvement. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Faculty of Technology Topic Department of Electronics The Department of Electronics was established in 1975. 
It has microwave electronics instrumentation and microprocessor research laboratories and the doctoral programs mainly in fields such as underwater acoustics, ocean electronics, microwave propagation antennas, microwave image processing, pattern recognition, microprocessor applications in signal processing and display devices. The department offers postgraduate programs that include MSc. Electronics and M-Tech Electronics with specializations in microwave and radar electronics and digital electronics. External agencies like the DST, ISRO, AICTE, DOE, DRDO, MOD and the state government support this department through research projects and fellowships. The department conducts two national symposia as biennial events, the National Symposium on Antennas and Propagation which commenced from 1988 and, the Symposium on Ocean Electronics from 1991 onwards. The department has established international collaboration with Delft University, Netherlands, Polarizone Corporation, Malaysia, University of Kent, England, and University of Surrey, England for different research projects. Topic Department of Instrumentation The Department of Instrumentation was established in the year 1995. Though it is a relatively young teaching and research department, it has a long history of evolution as it was derived from the University Science Instrumentation Center USIC. USIC was established in the university in 1978 as a service department with assistance from UGC. USIC has been extending instrumentation services to various science and technology departments of the university by way of design and fabrication, glass blowing, carpentry work etc. It has been carrying out consultancy work for other academic institutions, R&D organizations and industries as well. The center was elevated to the status of an academic department in the year 1995. From 1999 onwards, the department is offering four years eight semesters B.Tech course in instrumentation technology. M. Science degree course in instrumentation was started in 2011. The department has a research programs in the areas of instrumentation and applied physics. The department has implemented several research projects sponsored by external funding agencies like DST, DAE, UGC, AICTE, KSCSTE and TWAS. It also offers consultancy for the design, fabrication of experimental systems for teaching, research, calibration, industrial applications. Topic Department of Polymer Science and Rubber Technology The Department of Polymer Science and Rubber Technology PS and RT established in 1971 as one of the pioneers in the area of education and research in polymer science and engineering in collaboration with the Rubber Research Institute of India the BTech program was started in the year 1972. 
Major facilities in the department include basic rubber, plastic processing equipment, Windsor injection molding machine, Shimadzu Autograph Universal Testing Machines 50 kN and 10 kN, Alpha Technologies RPA 2000 Rubber Process Analyzer TA Dynamic Mechanical Analyzer Q800, TA DSC Q100, TA TGA Q50, Hitachi UV Visible Near Spectrophotometer, Bruker Tensor 27 FTIR, Zwick Impact Tester, Otago Abbey Regractometer, Keithley 2182 Nano Voltmeter, Waters 515 HPLC, Brookfield Viscometer, Carl Zeiss Stereo Microscope and Thermohawk Rheomics Poly Lab System. The department has successfully completed major projects sponsored by Nuffic MHO, the Netherlands, Volkswagen Foundation, Germany, MHRD, AICTE, DRDO, DST, and UGC. The department has had a successful collaborative association with the Eindhoven University of Technology Tuesday and University of Twente, the Netherlands. Topic department of Ship Technology The department is one of the pioneers in the field of naval architecture education in India, established in 1974. A B.Tech program in naval architecture and ship building was started in 1975. In technical collaboration with the University of Rostock, Germany since 1978, it is producing naval architects to meet the requirements of shipbuilding industry, ship classification societies, R&D organizations, the Indian Navy and other organizations. The department maintains collaborations with IITs, universities outside India, Naval Science and Technological Laboratory NSTL, Visage and Shipyards. These organizations extend their facilities and expertise to impart training to the B.Tech students. The Ministry of Shipping, Government of India, approved the B.Tech course for the MOT. Certificate Examination. The Indian Navy has recognised this department as a centre for the higher education of their officers. The department has a library, computer centre, laboratories and workshops. The faculty have over 100 research publications. The course is accredited by the Royal Institution of Naval Architects RENA, UK as satisfying the Engineering Council UK requirements for the registration at Stage 1 of the Chartered Engineer section. An academic collaboration took birth with Chosen University, Republic of Korea in 2003 whereby exchange of students and faculty members take place. Society of Naval Architecture Students or SNAS is a student organization of the Naval Architecture Students at the department, they organize seminars, various activities in the department. They also publish an annual technical magazine, SHIPSTECHNIC, which includes technical papers from the experts in the industry. Topic International School of Photonics The International School of Photonics ISP came into existence in 1995. 
Research activities include the design and fabrication of various laser systems and laser components, detailed investigations of nonlinear phenomena in different materials using photothermal, photoacoustic and related techniques, time and space resolved studies on laser-induced plasmas from a variety of targets, design and characterization of fiber optic sensors sensors, fabrication and characterization of polymer fibers, preparation and investigation of photonic materials and studies on photonics theory. Most of these activities are supported by funding agencies like DST, AICTE and UGC. ISP at present offers a four-semester M-Tech degree program in optoelectronics and laser technology and PhD program. The department conducts a workshop seminar in photonics annually during February. ISP has strong collaboration and interaction with a number of institutions such as Robert Gordon University, UK, Nanyang Technological University in Singapore and Tampere University of Technology, Finland. Leading organizations such as ISRO, Samir, NEST etc., select students from ISP through campus interviews. Major facilities include Master Optical Parametric Oscillator, High Power ND, YAG Laser, 12-watt Argon Ion Laser, Optical Fiber Drawing Facility and Ring Dye Laser. Thrust areas of research, laser technology fiber optic sensors nonlinear dynamics laser-induced plasma photothermal phenomena laser control by chaos nonlinear optics polymer optical and recognition of the pioneering work carried out by the laser group in this university during the past two decades. The University Grants Commission identified Cochin University of Science and Technology as a university with potential for excellence in the field of lasers and optoelectronics sciences in March 2002 and released an initial installment of grant of 5 crore rupees. Following this, a Center of Excellence in Lasers and Optoelectronics Sciences CELOS, was established in CUSAT in July 2002. The primary objectives of this center are to initiate and organize teaching, research and extension activities in this highly specialized field of lasers and optoelectronics. This is a major regional facility which will benefit the actual users from the different departments of CUSAT as well as from other research institutions and universities in this part of the country. The center has now been merged with International School of Photonics. Topic: <laughs> Department of Computer Applications. The Department of Computer Applications (DCA) was established in 1994 offering MCA program with the financial support and a model curriculum from UGC and the Department of Electronics, Government of India to facilitate research and human resource development in the subject. The syllabus is being updated periodically according to the latest technology, information security, simulation and modeling, cryptography and coding theory, language computing, algorithm, pattern recognition, web mining, graph theory and its applications, image processing, data mining. Networking and software engineering are the major research areas. The department has a library with more than 6,000 books and a good number of national, international, and online journals. 
The department has an active students organization SAMCA, which also manages the placement cell assisted by the faculty members. The SAMCA hosts special interest groups in subject areas in data mining, image processing, artificial intelligence, robotics, and cryptography. Topic Department of Computer Science The Department of Computer Science DCS focuses on academic programs. At present, three graduate programs are offered, M-Tech in Computer and Information Science M-Tech in Software Engineering. M. Tech in Computer Science with Specialization in Embedded Systems part-time DCS offers two full-time M. Tech programs, having due approval of the AICTE. Research programs leading to PhD in Computer Science, Computer Engineering as well as in Information Science, are also offered. Started in the academic year 1984–85, DCS has been supporting CUSAT in its computer-related activities. It was the seeding agent in establishing the Computer Center in 1989, with support from the UGC and the DRDO, and has been managing the center. Five batches of students of the MSc in Computer Software had graduated from DCS, specifically to serve the DRDO laboratories. The CUSAT intranet was conceived and commissioned by DCS, it also manages the net, along with the web server and the email server. It has supported and enriched the MCA program during the program's brief stint at DCS. Grants amounting to a total of around 10 crore rupees received from several funding agencies were managed by DCS based on projects it has initiated. The agencies include the MHRD, the DRDO, the UGC, the AICTE, the DST and the NUFIC of the Royal Government of the Netherlands. Two projects funded by the ISRO have been successfully implemented, more are in the offing. While the major focus of research is on information systems, the departmental research interests span the computer science spectrum, as well. Recent publications cover topics in high-speed computing, human-computer interaction, information security, networked embedded system, natural language processing, software engineering, VLSI, etc. The research laboratories have been augmented, developed using the 2007 MHRD grant. They are, 1. Human-Computer Interaction Laboratory HCI Lab 2. Embedded Systems Laboratory ESL 3. Mobile Computing Laboratory MCL 4. Software Engineering Laboratory SEL. Topic. Faculty of Engineering Topic School of Engineering Thrikakara School of Engineering was established in 1979 for offering part-time M-Tech. Programs in the major disciplines of engineering viz. civil, mechanical, electrical and chemical engineering for practicing engineers in and around Cochin. The school introduced B-Tech. Programs in civil engineering, mechanical engineering, 
Electronics and Communication Engineering, Computer Science and Engineering and Information Technology in 1995, which turned out to be a milestone in the growth of the school. B. Tech, in Safety and Fire Engineering was added in 1996 and Electrical and Electronics Engineering in 2003. Research activities were introduced in School of Engineering in 1981 with Ph.D. programs. The school has already produced 53 PhDs and more than 250 candidates have registered as research students at present. School of Engineering has been well accepted as a research center. A number of research projects have been sanctioned to the school by agencies like DST, Central Water Commission, ISRO, AICTE, Core Board, Kerala State Core Corporation, etc. These have helped to establish fully equipped laboratories and promote research activities. The research community of the school has published papers in international, national journals. B. Tech programs offered by School of Engineering, CUSAT have been accredited by the National Board of Accreditation NBA under Tier 1 system, National Board of Accreditation NBA has been accorded permanent signatory status to the Washington Accord on 13 June 2014. As per Washington Accord Agreement, recognition of programs by other signatories applies only to programs accredited by NBA that are offered by education providers accepted by NBA as Tier 1 institutions. Undergraduate courses B. Tech intake in brackets Civil Engineering 90. Computer Science and Engineering 90 Electrical and Electronics Engineering 60 Electronics and Communication Engineering 90 Information Technology 90 Mechanical Engineering 90 Safety and Fire Engineering 60 Postgraduate Course M Tech Full-time M-Tech courses Information Technology, Software Systems 18, Computer Science and Engineering, Networking Systems 18, Civil Engineering, Geotechnical Engineering 18, Mechanical Engineering, Thermal Engineering 18, Electronics and Communications Engineering Wireless Technology 18 Part-time M-Tech courses Civil Engineering 18 Mechanical Engineering 18 Chemical Engineering 18 Electrical Engineering 18 PhD programs all branches mentioned above Topic Kunjali Marikar School of Marine Engineering The Kunjali Marikar School of Marine Engineering offers the B Tech program in marine engineering. B Tech Marine Engineering course is a full time compulsory residential program. Students are provided with Merchant Navy Cadets uniform for attending classes and boiler suits, safety shoes and helmet for workshop use. Physical training is compulsory for the cadets and is given by trained personnel. Uniforms for PT are also provided to the students. The present annual intake in B Tech. Marine engineering is 80, through common admission test conducted by the university on all India basis. 
The school also provides short term pre requisite statutory courses in Engine Room Simulator for the students appearing for competency examination in Class 4 and Class 2 conducted by the Directorate General of Shipping. A full-time two-year M-Tech program in marine engineering with an annual intake of maximum 80 students started from the academic year 2014. Topic Cochin University College of Engineering, Kutanad Cochin University College of Engineering Kutanad was established in 1999 and owned by Cochin University of Science and Technology. It is situated in a 42-acre campus in Palinkano, Kutanad, the rice bowl of Kerala in Alapuja district, which is about 75 kilometers away from the main campus at Thrikakara. It is the only campus of CUSAT functioning outside Ernakulam district. It offers B.Tech programs in computer science, electrical and electronics, electronics and communication, information technology, mechanical engineering, civil engineering, and MCA. Computer Science and Engineering Electrical and Electronics Engineering Electronics and Communication Engineering Information Technology Mechanical Engineering Civil Engineering Computer Applications Topic. Faculty of Environmental Studies Topic School of Environmental Studies The School of Environmental Studies, a center for higher learning dedicated to environmental protection and sustainable development conceptualized in 1980, was established in 1983. The school is DST FIST sponsored and UGCSAP assisted. The school has achieved a grant of 75 lakh rupees under FIST program and 37 lakh rupees under UGCSAP program. The school conducted a study on urban governance service for climate resilience strategies, assessment of Cochin, India sponsored by Rockefeller Foundation and the Institute of Development Studies, University of Sussex, UK. The National Centre for Aquatic Animal Health NCAAH, attached to the School of Environmental Studies conducts a two-year M.Tech. Program sponsored by Department of Biotechnology, Government of India under its Network Program in Human Resource Development in Biotechnology. The MSc. Environmental technology is offered with specialization in two disciplines, Stream I, Environmental Engineering Stream II, Environmental Biotechnology. Doctoral program is offered in the areas of, Environmental Biology, Environmental Chemistry, Environmental Photocatalysis and Sonophotocatalysis, Environmental Microbiology, Environmental Management, Environmental Toxicology, Environmental Biotechnology, Environmental Engineering and Remote Sensing. The school is equipped with major equipments such as gas chromatograph, total organic carbon, TOC, analyzer, 
spectrophotometers, pulse field gel electrophoresis, inverted microscope, CO2 incubator, electrophoretic systems, plant growth chamber, luminometer and GIS workstation and other minor equipments like air sampler, BOD incubator, COD digester etc., required for environmental chemical analysis. The school has produced several PhDs. The school periodically conducts UGC-sponsored refresher courses for university and college teachers. It has also successfully completed externally funded research projects from agencies such as the UNESCO, IFS Sweden, OPCW, the Netherlands, DSTGOVT, of India, DBT, UGC, ICAR, Core Board, Stead Kerala, etc., while some are still ongoing. With its expertise and infrastructure, the school extends consultancy services in pollution monitoring, water quality management, water treatment, disease diagnosis and management of aquaculture systems, environmental impact assessment EIA, etc. The school has participated in the EIA of Metro Rail Project of Kochi City. The school carries out environmental surveys for local authorities and government agencies on baseline status and waste management practices. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Faculty of Humanities. Topic Department of Hindi The Department of Hindi, established in 1963, is one of the oldest departments of the university. It was a part of the Kerala University and joined the folds of University of Cochin when it was established in the year 1971. From the period of inception it has blossomed into one of the prestigious institutions among Indian university departments engaged in teaching and research of Hindi language and literature. The department is actively engaged in research in different areas like ancient and modern poetry, fiction, drama and theatre studies, criticism, grammar, linguistics, comparative studies of languages and literature, folk literature, translation, computer-aided language teaching etc. The department has completed four research projects including one on CALT, computer-aided language teaching. The DRS Phase 1, 2 and 3 have been completed by the department and the UGC has sanctioned next stage of SAP program i.e., DSA for a period of five years. The Department of Hindi is the only department in South India which got DRS and DSA programs in Hindi. Programs of study, research in the department M.A. Hindi Language and Literature M. Phil P.G. Diploma in Translational and Functional Hindi Ph.D. Short-term course in computer-based training and teaching in Hindi. Topic. Department of English and Foreign Languages The Department of English and Foreign Languages was initially established as the Department of Foreign Languages in 1976. This department is mainly involved in the teaching of English and foreign languages like French, German, Italian, Japanese and Russian. 
However, in order to give supreme importance to English language teaching and the cultural backdrop that encompasses each foreign language, the department was rechristened as the Department of English and Foreign Languages in 2012. Topic: <laughs> Faculty of Law. Topic: School of Legal Studies. Established as the PG Department of Law of the Kerala University in 1962 under the leadership of the late Professor Dr. A. T. Marcos, an internationally reputed jurist who was the founder director of the Indian Law Institute, New Delhi, and deputy judge of International Administrative Tribunal. The school has established an IPR depository consisting of rare books and journals with the aid of MHRD, Government of India. The World Intellectual Property Organization WIPO, a body of United Nations has donated its major publications to this depository. The MHRD has sanctioned a chair for IPR studies. In 2011, the UGC has provided funds under its Special Assistant Program to start courses in Corporate Governance and Securities Law. The Public Law Lecture Series established by the school has already produced commendable works in law and has received tremendous appreciation and applause. The LL.B. three-year program started in 1994 as an evening program is now a semesterized, full-time program. In 2006, five-year LL.B. Hans has been introduced. From 2009 onwards as directed by the Bar Council of India, the course has been remodelled and a BBA, LL.B. Hans, programme is offered. From 2013 BCom LL.B. Hans, course also has been introduced. A human rights chair in the name of late Justice V.R. Krishna Iyer has been established in the school. It enables interdisciplinary research and extension work in human rights values. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Faculty of Marine Sciences. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> School of Industrial Fisheries The Department of Industrial Fisheries was established in 1976. It offers expertise in various branches of fisheries science like fishery biology, capture fisheries, aquaculture, fishing technology, fish processing technology, fisheries economics and fisheries management. The department was upgraded as a school in 1995 in due recognition of various academic and scientific achievements. Five divisions viz. Aquaculture and capture fisheries Fishing technology Fish processing technology Fisheries economics Fisheries management – The school has developed research partnership with more than 32 countries in frontier areas of fisheries science such as aquaculture, capture fisheries, harvest and post-harvest technology and marine biodiversity. 
The activities also comprise staff secondment programs, visit of scientists on short and medium periods, organization of workshops, seminar, symposia, delivering of lectures etc. The school has carried out more than 10 international and 30 national research projects during the past decade funded by European Commission, NUFIC, Indo-Dutch Cooperation, Indo-Canadian Funding Assistance, Ministry of Earth Sciences, DOD, KSCSTE, ICAR FRMS, AUDIC, DODOSTC, NATICAR, World Bank and UNCTAD among others. Topic: <laughs> Department of Atmospheric Sciences. Department of Atmospheric Sciences is a center of excellence in teaching as well as research in the field of meteorology, atmospheric sciences and is located in the serene and beautiful lakeside campus of the Cochin University of Science and Technology. The department started offering a four-semester MSc course in meteorology since 1975 and a four-semester M.Tech course in atmospheric science since 1989. The course content of all the above courses is of international standard updating every three years. As per the scheme of the Government of India entitled New Millennium Indian Technology Leadership Initiative on mesoscale modelling for monsoon-related predictions, the Council for Scientific and Industrial Research has identified the Department of Atmospheric Sciences as one of centres of excellence to carry out research work in the frontier area along with other premier centers such as Indian Institute of Technology, Delhi, Indian Institute of Tropical Meteorology, Pune, Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore, Tata Institute of Fundamental Research, Mumbai, CMMACS, Bangalore and National Aerospace Laboratories, Bangalore. The department has high-speed computational facilities, and a full-fledged surface weather observatory consisting of an automatic weather station, sonic anemometer, micro-rain radar, high-resolution GPS radio sonde etc. It has also set up a data bank, which has NCEP, NCAR Reanalysis Global Data, UARS data from NASA, rocket data, MST radar data, surface weather observations, TOMS data, etc. Topic: <laughs> Department of Chemical Oceanography. The Department of Chemical Oceanography has credentials of facilities and rich expertise in teaching, research on various chemical aspects of the aquatic system. It has pioneered investigations in many an area of vital significance and has contributed valuable inputs into the national database. Chemical oceanography marine chemistry is the fulcrum for interaction between the various disciplines of marine sciences. Sophisticated instrumental facilities available in the department include UV vis spectrophotometer, AAS, GC, HPLC, GCMS, LCMS, FTIR, polarographic analyzer, laminar flow chambers, etc. The department is actively engaged in consultancy and extension activities that include analytical testing, training, water quality analysis etc.
Topic: <laughs> Department of Marine Biology, Microbiology and Biochemistry. The Department of Marine Biology, Microbiology and Biochemistry is an integral part of School of Marine Sciences. It is one of the first and foremost academic centers in marine biology in the country. The MSc program in marine biology was started in 1958. The department is engaged in research right from its inception in 1938 and more than 100 students have taken their PhDs in different areas of marine biology, microbiology and biochemistry. Besides MSc and PhD programs, the department also offers an MPhil program in life sciences. The department has excellent infrastructure for teaching, research and training in the basic and applied frontiers of these disciplines. The facilities include a sophisticated central instrumentation lab with facilities such as different kind of microscopes for taxonomic and other related works, gas chromatography, talk, HPLC, transmission electron microscope, freeze dryer, fluorescence, UV, visible and atomic absorption spectrophotometers, gas chromatograph, particle size analyzer, blood analyzer, gel documentation system, PCR, RT-PCR, water quality analysis and flow through system for experiments. Researchers from the department named a new species after the university, Victoria Pisa Casatensis. Topic: <laughs> Department of Marine Geology and Geophysics. Earth science education is enhancing its relevance and scope globally owing to recent advances in geoexploration and the role it has in environmental and developmental issues. CUSAT is one of the premier universities in the country to begin a full-fledged post-graduate program in marine geology in the year 1976 taking into account the global advancement in general and national needs in particular in the field of marine science. A three-year MSc, Tech, program in marine geophysics was introduced in 1992 which has now been restructured into a two-year MSc, program. <laughs> Department of Physical Oceanography To cater the needs of physical oceanographers for this country, a postgraduate program in oceanography commenced in 1965 at the erstwhile Department of Marine Biology and Oceanography under University of Kerala which later came under the Physical Oceanography and Meteorology Division of University of Cochin. In 1996, the Department of Physical Oceanography was established and the course was continued to offer under the department. In 2001, a new course in M-Tech. Ocean technology commenced in the department aimed to explore the technological aspects of the oceans for the benefit of the nation. Topic. Faculty of Medical Sciences and Technology Topic. Department of Biotechnology 
The Department of Biotechnology was established in 1991. The MSc, course in Biotechnology which was started in the Department of Applied Chemistry was later transferred to the department with an annual student intake of 10. It offers a Ph.D. program. The professional MSc course is designed to train students in frontier areas of biotechnology. The research activities of the department are on areas in microbiology, molecular neurobiology and cell biology, medical biochemistry, genetic engineering and plant biotechnology. Topic: Faculty of Social Sciences. Topic: Department of Applied Economics. The department offers a postgraduate degree in Applied Economics (M.A. Applied Economics, M.Phil, and Ph.D. programs. The department's research focuses on economics of technology. Apart from economics, two areas where the department has teaching capability are econometrics and operations research. Cochin City has an industrial belt and a coastal area suitable for fishing activities. The industrial and fishing activities have contributed much to environmental pollution in the area. Therefore, the department researches the technology problems of industry and the fisheries sector, and the economics of the environment. <laughs> School of Management Studies The School of Management Studies SMS is one of the oldest academic units of the university. Being one among the first five management schools to be established in the country, it started functioning in the premises of the Fertilizers and Chemicals Travancore Limited fact in October 1964 as a part of Kerala University with Professor Emeritus Dr. M. V. Piley as the director. When University of Cochin was formed in the year 1971, which later became Cochin University of Science and Technology, the school became an integral part of the university. Since then, the school has dabbled in management education. It pursues four areas of academic activity teaching, training, research and consultancy. SMS offers the following programs 1. MBA full -time. 2. MBA part -time. 3. MPhil commerce and 4. PhD program Topic Centers Topic Center for Science in Society, C Cis The Center for Science in Society was established in 1991 under the UGC-8 Plan Development Assistance with Partial Financial Assistance from Cochin Refineries Limited. It is instituted as endowment BPCL Chair – Professor in the university. The center conducts various programs about science with the view to popularize science and technology among children. 
Government of Kerala has approved CSIS as a training centre for high school science teachers under the Sastrapasini programme. The Indian Space Research Organisation has put up a space pavilion in the Science and Technology Park of CSIS. Models of their space rockets, Chandrayaan and video shows of rocket launching from Sriharikota will be shown to the visitors. The US-based IEEE Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers has come forward to establish an e electronics scientific exhibit in the Science and Technology Park of CSIS. The trajectory monitoring and error correction in the process of satellite launching are shown to the group of students who visit CSIS. Topic Sophisticated Test and Instrumentation Center STIC STIC is a joint venture of the Kerala State Council for Science, Technology and Environment KSCSTE and Cochin University of Science and Technology CUSAT. This institution has been established with the following objectives: 1 provide advanced instrument facilities for analysis testing, measurement and calibration to users from industries, academic institutions and R&D establishments. 2. Undertake research and development in the field of instrumentation and related areas relevant to industries in the state. 3 undertake training and other services for personnel from industries, R&D establishments and academic institutions. In addition to regular calibration, testing and analysis activities, the scientific personnel in STIC are involved in research and development in instrumentation and allied areas. A. STIC has set up the following facilities to carry out its activities. b. NABL accredited calibration laboratories electro-technical, thermal, and mechanical c. testing laboratories electrical, plastics, mechanical d. Sophisticated Analytical Instrument Facility SAFE, supported by Department of Science and Technology, Government of India, E. Instrumentation R&D Laboratory <laughs> National Centre for Aquatic Animal Health NCAAH. NCAAH formerly Center for Fish Disease Diagnosis and Management was established on the 18th of January 2000 to cater to the requirement of aqua farmers in protecting health of rearing stock through the introduction of the recent advancements in marine biotechnology and situates in the lakeside campus of the university. Motto of the center is relentless effort for the protection of health of aquatic animals and their environment. NCAAH is the seventh regional resource center (RRC) in aquatic animal health of the network of aquaculture centers in Asia Pacific (NACA), which has its headquarters at Bangkok, Thailand. As an RRC, the center is mandated to provide scientific and technical training of personnel from the South Asian region, diagnostic testing facilities to countries who are members of the Regional Aquatic Animal Health Initiative, organize scientific meetings, training courses and workshops for NACA, dissemination of information and other such initiatives in aquatic animal health. 
The center is equipped with research labs such as bacteriology, virology, animal tissue culture, immunology, genomics, proteomics and fermentation. An extensive bioassay system with ROS is another feature. The center offers an M-Tech program in marine biotechnology sponsored by Department of Biotechnology, Government of India. Topic Center for the Study of Social Exclusion and Inclusive Policy CSSEIP. The UGC Center has, since the starting of its formal work in February 2009, engaged in building the required intellectual infrastructure for furthering research in the broad agenda of social exclusion. Following the general approach to social exclusion research, the center examines social exclusion as both a process and a status. Developing on this scheme of examining social exclusion, the center advocates in its research for inclusive policy the process status process approach i.e. identify and examine the process that led to social exclusion, evaluate the present status, magnitude of social exclusion and chart out processes to achieve the desired level of social inclusion. The center has identified as its core research themes a digital exclusion b housing and basic amenities exclusion c socio-cultural and structural determinants of exclusion d spatial exclusion and e demographic dimensions of exclusion Topic Inter-University Center for IPR Studies IUCIPRS Inter-University Center for IPR Studies IUCIPRS is an autonomous institution established by the Government of Kerala in Cochin University of Science and Technology. This is one of the inter-university centers conceived and implemented by the Department of Higher Education, Government of Kerala. The Center for IPR Studies established in the School of Legal Studies of the Cochin University of Science and Technology in 2003 is converted into IUCIPRS to encourage multidisciplinary teaching and research in the area of intellectual property rights. IUCIPRS is governed by a governing council consisting of 12 members with the Minister for Education and Culture, Government of Kerala as Chairman and Vice-Chancellor of CUSAT as Vice-Chairman. <laughs> International Centre for Economic Policy and Analysis ICEPA. The International Centre for Economic Policy and Analysis ICEPA was an offshoot of the international collaboration the Department of Applied Economics had in the 1990s and 2000s. The original request for the development of this centre came from the international collaborators so as to sustain the system with continuous linkage. ICEPA was established in the year 2004 April in the Department of Applied Economics, CUSAT for analyzing the economic issues and giving guidelines to authorities for taking policy decisions. Currently, the center is carrying out research projects from national and international agencies and is also engaging in development dialogues with national and international NGOs as well as with industries and governments.
Important works undertaken by the center since its inception include studies relating to the World Bank, the European Union, the Royal Netherlands Embassy, Development Research Institute, the Netherlands, the Royal Netherlands Embassy Press and Culture Affairs, New Delhi, the Tilburg University, Ministry of Agriculture, Government of India, Ministry of Plantation, Government of India, Kerala Shipping and Inland Navigation Corporation Limited, etc. Topic. See also List of colleges affiliated with Cochin University of Science and Technology